I mean, if you think about this, it's absolutely mind-boggling that the writer was able to pull all this together. Now, if I give this to my Orthodox Jewish friends, and I've done this on many, on many, several occasions, they'll say, wow, Matthew wanted to say, this guy is from 777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777777
And again, I get people all worked up who say, well then, the only way you can read the Bible is to have somebody in your church who can explain the culture. Yes! <laughs> Why do you think Jesus said, go to the Jew first and then to the Greek? You think he meant like Greeks, go to the Jew, if every one of them in the whole world doesn't immediately believe, spit on them and go to the Goy, the Gentile. Or did Jesus mean every single time you begin to build a community of faith, you've got to have some Jews there because if you don't, who's going to tell you this stuff? And by what we did to our Jewish brothers and sisters in history has devastated our ability not to get the text right. I happen to believe our theology is good and right. But to see the depth of the text. <laughs> um, I forgot to put my numbers here. Oops. All right, let's look at a couple of others besides the... No oh! <laughs> An Easterner with their concrete stuff wants to deal with relationship. How do you experience God? The Westerner, with our need for information, wants to know about God. I made my commitment to Jesus when I was 15 years old. Uh, 16 years old. On my way home, I'm, I'm in my car, I'm stopped at a train crossing in Michigan, there's a train going back and forth. I'm thinking to myself, the devil would have given the same answer to those questions that I did tonight. What do you have to know to be saved? What are the sacraments? What is true faith? It's all about information. The devil knows this stuff better than you do. He was there. The question is, do you know God? So the Jew says, the Greek says, God is omnipotent. Now I know something about him. Tell me when, when is the last time you had a deep personal experience with omnipotent? And I want to know what you were, never mind. Okay? The, the Easterner says, Abba. Daddy. Wait till the next time you're in Israel. And some little kid gets lost in the airport. And is going, Abba, Abba. And then he sees her, she sees Abba. And runs and, Abba. You'll be face to face with God himself because he said, call me Abba. Don't call me omnipotent. Call me Abba. I'm your daddy. Now, if you want to know I'm omnipotent, wonderful. Find the proof texts. But know me first. Then know about me. 